Hey what is up guys and girls, my name is Sam and in this tutorial I'll be showing you an easy way to rebind your mouse buttons in Path of Exile. Now the reason I've done this is because I've had my middle mouse button set to my push to talk button for many years in voice over IP programs and if you press middle mouse button in Path of Exile even without a skill set to that keybind it makes you do all sorts of weird shit. Now especially since I play on hardcore it's really the last thing I want happening. Now what you're going to do is you need to download a third party program and the one I found which does this best is one called ATN Soft Key Remapper. Uh, you can download this using the link in the description. When you click on it, it should bring you to this web page, and all you need to do is just click on the download link right here. It is worth noting that this is a 30 day trial, but hopefully by the time the 30 day trial is, um, is over, they would have added more keybind options to the game. I uh, really do hope that, otherwise that's pretty bad. Once it's downloaded, just open it up and run through the install process as per usual. Um, I've already got this installed on my system, so I'm not going to install it again. But once you finish the install, open up the program and you should be looking at something like this. Now as you can see, I've already got the rules created, but I'll be opening them up one by one so you can copy the settings over easily. To create a rule, you just double click here and this will bring up a window like this. Now the first rule we're going to be creating is a block rule. Now this will basically stop the keybind from working completely in Path of Exile, but not in applications that are running in the background such as TeamSpeak, Ventrilo, Mumble and so on. So first things first, in the key or mouse button section, you need to click the key that you want to rebind. In my case it's middle mouse button. And in the apply drop down, It'll be selected everywhere, I believe, as default. And what you need to do is you need to add an exception. Now, what this will do is it'll make the rule only apply to Path of Exile. So, click on Add an Exception. It'll bring up this window. The name doesn't really matter. And you need to tick the radial that says only in the specified programs and or windows. Once you've done that, you need to point the rule to the exe of the application. In this case, Path of Exile. And you can do this in two ways. You can either do this by adding the EXE through a list of currently running programs or you can click on open and point to the directory manually. Once you've done that, click on OK. And at the bottom here you need to tick the radio that says block, full block, including with modifiers. Now the modifiers part doesn't really apply to Path of Exile, but I did it just in case. Now we're going to be adding the second rule or the remap rule which is going to basically rebind the key that we just blocked to a new keybind. So double click to add, it'll bring up the same window again and in the top box we're going to enter the keybind that we want to remap it to. So in this case I've used mouse button 4. In the apply drop down you want to make sure that PoE is selected again because we only want this to apply to Path of Exile. And we want to replace by the following key, mouse button key combination and enter the key that we just blocked, in this case middle mouse button. I believe that this is uh, selected automatically to synchronously, if not make sure it is. And then click OK. And that is literally it. Feel free to ask me any questions in the comments or let me know if this helped you out and I'll see you later. Thanks for watching.